Hi all, welcome to the Salesforce Ultimate Guide channel. In this video, we are going to again continue with our trigger scenarios. Question number 24. If the account billing address is updated, then update the related contacts mailing address using map. Okay, we have uh, seen similar uh, uh, scenario in uh, like uh, before one more video. So in this video, we are going to do the like similar uh, trigger scenario. But here we are uh, copying the address of the account in the related context. Okay, so uh, we will start with our trigger. On trigger 24 on account so you can see like right now there is no active trigger running in my sandbox so now i'm going to start this after update since uh, we have to make changes in the contact record when uh, um, billing address got updated in the account so the very first step we will check if trigger dot dot is after and trigger dot is update after this we start with our for loop or account acc in trigger dot new yeah now the very first thing is we need to check whether the address got updated or not any or any account got updated so to check that we will go with the if condition within this we are going to write first i will fetch all the uh, fields so control shift open account object okay then we need to check the updated then billing address of the account okay so billing address is billing city billing country billing state street and postal code okay so to take these values here <coughs> Billing city acc dot billing city is not equal to we need to compare with the old old values so old we values we can get with trigger dot old map dot get top acc dot id dot billing city okay the very first condition either the billing city should have changed or the next condition would be uh billing country okay so acc dot billing country is not equal to the trigger dot old map dot get of yours account id dot billing country okay or so again we have to check for all the five conditions if anything is got updated also we need to make the changes that's why i'm writing all the uh, or conditions so the very next thing will be cc dot billing state is not equal to the billing state and then i am giving the or condition and once more i need to take billing state this time Billing street is not equal to the trigger dot old map dot get of account top billing street. And we have one more last condition. So in this one, ACC dot billing postal code is not equal to the Billing postal code, and also along with this, we just need to do a end with uh, this whole thing. I'll be putting in one brace, 
when I am just going to check trigger dot old man is not equal to null. Okay. So in this if condition, we checked all the if the billing cities got updated, countries are got updated, billing state, billing street, billing commercial code. If any one of the value got updated and the trigger dot old map is not equal to null, we are going to work on this. Uh, if any thing is missing here, okay, we need yeah everything is covered. So after this if condition, uh, we have to do the uh, Low, so right now we want to get all these account IDs because uh, that will help us to update with the contacts. So map of ID comma account. Outside the for loop, I'll create one map of ID comma account. Account map is equal to new ID comma account. This and then I'll add all these values to account dot map dot put. ACC dot ID comma ACC. So I'll put the uh, account ID as well as the account record in this one. I'll try to fix the indentation. Yeah. So uh, in this for loop, we got all the account IDs. Now it is time for the contacts. Then I'll write one more loop for loop on contact on and we need a uh, sql query select id comma now we need to match which uh, contacts are having these above same account ids okay to get those so we have a account id field on the contact from contact where Now it's time to pass the uh, account IDs. So account IDs is in account map dot key set. So in this key set, we have all the account IDs. So we are passing them and we are fetching all the contacts which are matching with them. So we, are, we just need to check if ACC map dot contains key so if it matches with the contacts contacts account id if it is matches then it is time to copy all the values so contacts for contact we want the fields as from the mailing address okay so we will go to the contact.obj where are all the mailing yeah mailing city mailing country postal code state and street i'll query this okay now it will be helpful for me to write the things here so mailing city is going to be uh so now we need to take the help of this uh yeah we have the account map dot get top contacts account id then dot i need to get at the billing city so billing city field so what we are doing is contacts mailing uh, city we are going to store using in this account map we are having the uh whole account record so we, we will pass this particular account id which belongs to the contact so if it is matches from that we are fetching the billing city so we have to do the same thing for five more four more fields so contact dot mailing country Equal to the same thing again account map dot get of contact dot account id and then mailing is billing billing country so where the billing country this is the billing country yeah for three more fields we need to do the same thing what is going to be
and then contact dot mailing state then mailing street finally is going to be account map dot get of mailing street mailing street yeah now all the field values are copied the very next thing is we need to put it in a list so i'll define a list list of contact contact list is equal to the new list of contact so in this con list i need to add this contact finally i will come out of the for loop so it is ending at here then i'll check if not of contact list dot is empty then i'm going to just update the contact list i think we have written it correctly we will check from ui once I'm going to yeah the account test account. There are two contacts here, and right now is there any mailing mailing address is blank for this? So if I go to the account and uh, there is no billing 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 address. Yeah, right now there is no billing address. I'm going to give the billing address that uh, Vijayanagara. Bangalore, Karnataka, India. Okay, I'm going to save this. As soon as I saved it here, I, if I go to the related contacts, here I can see that the mailing address got copied from the account. So if I go to check and other contact as well, here also the mailing address got uh, updated with this particular address information so it was a little bit tricky but anyway uh, this is the approach we are doing so that will make us like instead of writing within for loop the for loop that is not a good practice that will fail for bulk records so we are using the map and uh, first we are fetching all the account ids later we are fetching all the contact records so on in the contact records we are copying the value and uh, <clears throat> then adding it to a list and finally updating a list so this is how the trigger works for this particular scenario i think if you guys have liked this uh, please click the like button as well as share with your friends if you have any feedback on this video how to improve and all you can comment it on the comment section that will encourage me to come up with more good videos uh thank you so much